Delineation of the extent of early gastric cancer by magnifying narrow band imaging and chromoendoscopy, a multicenter randomized controlled trial. Introduction. Accurate delineation of cancer margins is necessary for deciding on a treatment plan for early gastric cancer, EGC, and for achieving complete resection by endoscopic or open surgery. In Japan, conventional white light imaging followed by chromoendoscopy using indigo carmine solution is now widely used for delineating the margins of gastric cancers. Chromoendoscopy is an effective means of delineating margins and determining the detailed surface structure of the gastric mucosa associated with cancer infiltration. However, several studies that evaluated the ability of chromoendoscopy to delineate the margins of EGCs found that chromoendoscopy failed to delineate the entire margin in 18.9% to 21.6% of patients. Margin delineation by chromoendoscopy using high-resolution endoscopy thus appears to be inaccurate in about 20% of patients. Recently, magnifying endoscopy with narrowband imaging, MNBI, has enabled observation of the microvascular and microsurface patterns of gastric mucosa. Yao et al. have devised a vessel plus surface classification system for diagnosing gastric cancer by magnifying endoscopy that uses both microvascular and microsurface morphological findings. EGC is widely diagnosed by MNBI based on the vessel plus surface classification system in clinical practice and its superiority to conventional white light endoscopy in differentiation between cancers and non-cancers has been demonstrated in a multicenter randomized controlled trial. MNBI is also reportedly useful for delineating the margins of EGC and strong consensus has been reached regarding the utility of this technique. However, to date there is insufficient evidence to determine the usefulness of MNBI in delineating the margins of EGC. Therefore, the aim of this multicenter randomized controlled trial was to investigate superiority of MNBI in terms of accurate delineation rate compared with chromoendoscopy, which is the standard method in Japanese current practice. Background Accurate delineation of tumor margins is necessary for curative resection of early gastric cancer, EGC. The objective of this multicenter randomized controlled study was to compare the accuracy with which magnifying narrow band imaging, MNBI, and indigo carmine chromoendoscopy delineate EGC margins. Methods Patients with EGC greater than or equal to 10 mm undergoing endoscopic or surgical resection were enrolled. The oral side margins of the lesions were first evaluated with conventional white light endoscopy in both groups and then delineated by either chromoendoscopy or MNBI. Biopsies were taken from non-cancerous and cancerous mucosa, each at 5 mm from the margin. Accurate delineation was judged to have been achieved when the histological findings in all biopsy samples were consistent with endoscopic diagnoses. The primary endpoint was the difference in rate of accurate delineation between the two techniques. Results. Data on 343 patients were analyzed. The accurate delineation rate, 95% confidence interval, was 85.7%. 80.4 to 91.0 in the chromoendoscopy group, N equal 168, and 88.0%, 83.2 to 92.8 in the MNBI group, N equal 175, P equal 0 0.63. Lower third tumor location, odds ratio, OR, 2.9, P equals 0 0.01, non-flat macroscopic type, OR 4.4, P less than 0 0.01, and high diagnostic confidence, OR 3.6, P less than 0 0.001, were associated with accurate delineation, whereas use of MNBI was not, OR 1.2, P equals 0 0.39. Even after adjustment for identified confounders, the difference in accurate delineation between the groups was not significant, OR 1.0, P equals 0 0.82. Conclusions. MNBI does not offer superior delineation of EGC margins compared with chromoendoscopy. The two methods appear to be clinically equivalent.